नमस्ते मैं सब्जेवियन गौरव गोयल फ्रॉम द फैकल्टी फिजिक्स थेरेपी एंड डायग्नोस्टिक इन द डिसिप्लिन ऑफ रेडियोलॉजी हमेशा खुश रहो बच्चे टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सेशन द बीम डायरेक्टिंग डिवाइसेस और स्पेशली द रेशियो कंपनसेटर रेशियो कंपनसेटर सो बीम मॉडिफिकेशन डिवाइस इज टू फाइंड एज Beam modification device is defined uh, uh, defined as desirable modification in the spatial dis uh, distribution of radiation within the patient by insertion of any material in the beam path. Like if uh, if, uh, if we uh, if we uh, uh, insert any shielding block, compensator, any type of phase filter, uh, uh, or any type of absorber. it absorbs the beam and modify the distribution of the radiation there are four type of beam modification device or beam modification uh, 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 devices first one is shielding second one is compensation third one is rays filtration fourth one is flattening okay so these are the these are the uh, uh, four Uh, uh, four inserted inserted mechanism in beam path. So let me discuss about the compensator tissue compensator beam modification. It is a beam modification device which even out uh, the skin surface contour while retaining the skin sparing advantage. Okay. it allows normal depth rose data to used for such irregular surface so it is used to uh, uh, in the case of irregular surfaces compensator can also used to compensate for tissue heterogeneity heterogeneity means uh, the uh, distribution of tissue is not uh, same uh, manner or not the same this is uh, this we the primary use this uh, 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 was primarily used in total body radiation to compensate for those irregularities arising due to reduced scatter near the field edges and holes in the beam profile so tissue compensators compensate the regular surface when we are treating the uh, uh, the um, when we are treating the uh, uh, the uh, full body full body radiation or uh, when we are treating the uh, full body okay so next we are discussing about the bolus 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 is also a bolus is uh, bolus is also used for uh, or to uh, to remove the uh, irregular surfaces irregular tissue shape it must be possible to mold the bolus to fill the tissue space it is loosely packed in polythene bags shape of the skin surface These bags are usually smoothed to achieve a flat surface, so it it convert uh, it convert a irregular surface into the flat surface after using it on the skin surface, modifying those at a skin surface and depth. the bolus is made up of gauze wax or tissue equivalent material so the uh, gauze wax and uh, any other and other material perspex bolus is used so these are the material 
that use it to make the board. So, other uh, other beam modification devices or beam modification techniques uh, are asymmetric saw, materialis collimator, flattening uh, filter, beam flattening uh, filter, and field shaping blocks, custom blocking, and wave filter. So let me discuss about the uh, asymmetric zones. It is used when we want uh, when a uh, technician want to block a weak part of the field without change without changing the position by the center. Independently movable zone. So it is used when a uh, uh, technician want to, to block the part of field without changing the IC center. Independently moving uh, movable jaw allow us to seal a part of field of view, part of field. Okay, like if, uh, if we open uh, the, uh, two jaws like X or Y jaws, then uh, we can uh, we can block one part like X1 or Y1 part of jaw. to block the field and this can be used for beam splitting here beam is blocked off at the central axis to remove hypergence use of the uh, use of asymmetric jaw results in the shift of isosceles curve so it will reduce the shift of isosceles curve uh, this is due to the elimination of photon and electron scatter from the blocked part of the field. So next we are discussing about the flattening filter. A beam flattening filter reduces the central exposure rate relative to that near the edges of the beam. Okay, so flattening filter uh, 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 reduce the central exposure rate, but uh, but it accept accept the uh, uh, age of the beam. Okay, so flattening filter reduce the uh, central exposure rate of central uh, beam central beam to convert or change the shape of the isosceles curve. If we are not using the flattening filter uh, or without flattening filter, the shape of the uh, shape of the isosceles curve is conical. So we are going to uh, we are going to use a, a flattening filter to change the shape. Okay, due to lower scatter, the isosceles curve that exhibit forward peaking. Forward peaking. The filter is designed so that the thickest part in the center, thickest part in the center. Uh, material used copper or brass. So, flattening filter is, is made of a copper or brass material. Next, there. Uh, next, uh, we are discussing the field shaping block. The field shaping blocks help to minimize uh, minimize the dose to helps to minimize the dose to the normal tissue as well as uh, the vital organ. The shaping of a treatment so it is used to minimize the dose to the normal tissue or surrounding tissue or vital or critical organ. The shaping uh, the shaping of the treatment field is decided. Uh, by the target volume. Field shaping uh, can be done by the shielding blocks made of lead. The thickness, the thickness of lead required to provide adequate protection of shielding area depends on the beam quality and allowed transmission through the blocks. So, a primary beam transmission, uh, transmission. 
5% through the block is acceptable for most clinical situations. So, primary beam. In the case of primary beam, uh, there is a uh, uh, there is a accepted there is a accepted uh, uh, accepted leakage is 5% through the block. Such a thickness of 4.5. 4.5 uh, to 5 SPL of lead would give less than 5% primary beam transmission. So 4.5 to 5 SPL of lead would give less than 5% primary beam transmission. The lead blocks are usually uh, placed above the patient, placed above the patient on a transparent tray between the path, between the uh, source and the patient. On a transparent tray, the, these uh, blocks having some cues, so these are fitted on the transparent tray, plastic tray, called shadow tray. It, uh, the tray is called shadow tray. The blocks should be shaped or tapered so that their sides follow the geometrical divergence of the beam. The however divergent block offer little advantage over covert C beam since it has large geometrical penumbra. So this is the field disrupting. The field disrupting block is, uh, is used for shape the field or uh, uh, reduce reduce the uh, reduce the dose or exposure to the normal tissue or critical organ. After applying the uh, after applying or insertion insertion uh, after insertion of uh, uh, the shielding block the intensity of the photon is reduced custom block custom block is made by low melting alloy called Lipovids method. This material consists of 50% bismuth, 26.7% lead, 13.3% tin, and 10% cadmium. These are the uh, material that is uh, mixed in this alloy, Lipovids metal, or, or custom blocks are made up of Lipovids metal that is a low melting alloy. It melts at about 70 degrees Celsius and therefore can be cast into any shape at room temperature uh, at room temperature it is harder then lead. It is harder than lead. Hmm. The minimum thickness required is 7.5 cm for mega voltage photon beam. So, minimum thickness required for seven, uh, is 7.5 cm for mega voltage photon beam. Okay, so uh, in this session, we had discussed about the uh, custom block, shielding block, compensator, at first compensator, and polar. So, this session is uh, uh, particularly important for radiotherapy applications or shielding material that is used in the radiotherapy to seal the normal tissues and by uh, according to the shape and uh, uh, according to the shape and the critical organ or vital organ. Okay. I think you are satisfied with this session. If you have any queries, then put it into the comment box. I will resolve it later. Thank you. The session is powered by digital version 2.0 JVWU Jet. Thank you.
थैंक यू वेरी मच